Should have told me. This is ridiculous, so I think we should go. No, we can't, can we? We'll just phone her and say we, we was waiting here and, you know, that's it. I mean, that's ridiculous. No, I've been phoning, it's engaged all the time. Anyway, we can't. I promised. I'm sure I see the curtain move, you know that. And, the, I mean, the, you don't leave your windows open either. I think she's in there. Well, just, just, Kev, let's just go, mate. Just phone her and say we waited here and she's got to pay for our time. I can't. I can't do that. Look, I was doing some work around Dame Judy Dench's place right the other week. Yeah. She's asked me, could I do her a favour and do this woman's house? So oh. obviously I, I had to say, yeah, hey, look, look, look at the name. What's that? What's that say then? It says Diamond, doesn't it? Oh, Diamond. Diamond. Well, that's uh, Anne Diamond's house then? Well, no, it's not Anne Diamond's house. I don't, I don't, it might be her sister's house. I don't know. I'm not sure. I just keeps giving this address. I wish... Why don't you tell me? Well, I, I don't have to tell you everything, do I? What do you, what do you, you, know, what do you want to know for? Well, you know, Anne Diamond. I've got, like, all Anne's books. The girl next door, how to lose a stone in a month. I, I mean, I could have brought them. She, I could have got a sister to sign them for me. Well, what good's it her signing your, your books? You want Anne Diamond to sign them. You don't want her sister, if it is her sister. Well, she's that? still a diamond. She could have just signed diamond. Well, that we don't know if it is her sister, do we? I've just given the address, you know, it's just, you know, through, you know. I just wish you would have told me. I've been sitting here scratching my nuts waiting and, you know, I didn't know it was Anne Diamond. Well, we don't even know if it's Anne Diamond yet. We don't know if it's Anne Diamond's sister or just, you know, it was working around Dame Judy's. It ain't Anne Diamond. It's got to be her sister's house. Well, it probably is her sister's house. I, I, you know, I haven't been given the full info. All I know is I was told to be here. Anne Diamond's out of order. Yeah. How long have you been reading her books then, How to Lose Weight and all that stuff? Well, that, How to Lose Weight in a Month. I've yeah. been reading that about four or five months. I'm slow to read her. Yeah. Ain't doing much good, is it? Well, I ain't finished it yet. So anyway, as I was saying, I was round um, Dame Judy's, because I know her well, I've done a lot of work around there. And uh, there was Simon Callow here, Alan Bennett, smashing blokes. And uh, this is a few years I mean, ago. you think Anne Diamond oh. would get her sister a decent car, because, like, you know, that that little motor, yeah, it's not, it don't look worth no. two bob, is it? What? Well, yeah, but maybe Anne Diamond's got, a lot, you know, got a lot of relatives. She can't weigh out for everybody. She's only earning so much, mate. I mean, it's not like she's high profile anymore. That's all I'm saying. I just wish you would have. Well, well, no, we'll no, give her no. a little bit longer. Give her a bit longer. Right. Give her a little bit longer. So, as in, you know, I was round there. That Simon Callow, he's in the shooting. Did you know that? You know what I'm talking about, don't you? The one off of um That's it, yeah, him. Yeah. So uh he's tipped up, he's got a lovely new Range Rover. Beautiful shine on it, polymer based obviously. And uh we went shooting. Even I mean, even if we don't do the job, mm -hmm. she she could possibly if I could give her the book, she could possibly get Anne to sign them for us, couldn't she? No, I dare say, yeah, yeah, I dare say. But, you know, I mean, Anne Diamond might be, I don't know, book signing up north or something. I don't know. I mean, you could leave your books around here. But I don't know how long they're going to be here, mate. I mean, you... I don't want to just leave them around anyone's house. I mean, I don't even know <coughs> if I trust the woman. The thing, thing is, what you've got to learn is when you're dealing with these kind of people, mm. right, is you don't want to impose on them. Let them ask first. So when we get in there, you go, oh... Yeah. I've got her books. Yeah. Oh, wish she'd have been here to sign them. Yeah. And then leave it, right? Just let it lie. Gotcha, yeah. And then if she says, oh, bring them round, I'll get them to sign them for you, that's mm. all right. Mm. But if you go in there like, bang, straight away, wait, can I leave these here? 
get your sister to sign them, don't look good. She's not professional in any in any in any way whatsoever. You know what I'm saying?